Hello friends, I'm back for some more fishing. Oh boy, I'm already snagged. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Um, fishing a even smaller stream than I did before. This is just, cause it we got a really good amount of rain yesterday. So we're trying some tiny spots. Maybe we'll go to a slightly bigger stream if this is too clear. Looking for uh, tea colored water, I would say. Where it's, doesn't look like chocolate milk, but it's not clear. This almost looks like that, just a little too clear, I think, but. My Padre is here with me. He's somewhere up here, who knows. I'm gonna try to navigate this and not get sunk in the mud. Hope you're all doing well and enjoy this video. Oops. Well, I found a spot. Beat old Gear to it. I'm not, he's not even able to fish this from here anyway, so I'll fish this side. He can fish. The other side looks a little nicer anyways. Hey, you got a nice spot over here for you. Yeah, you got the nicer side if you can get to it. I'm gonna try to sneak in here. Nice spot right here where we can't really get anything in here. Right. That's what makes it so nice. Yeah, yeah, I can't really get to it. Get to a better from ever. Right over there, you can get to it. Uh oh. And if I hook the tree. Come on, come on. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna have to get in this, unfortunately. Yank. Got it. Oh. Small stream fishing is hard sometimes. But I like it's all it's pretty much I keep getting my Oh Hey, got it. Just the key is to be patient with those. Oh. Oh, no. Okay. The hook broke off my lure. It's hookless. Well, that's not going to work. No. Oh, I got it. Yes. Yes. Oh my gosh. Well, I tried my luck again and that one didn't work either. <laughs> oh, these spots you only get about one cast. You got a Sunday at Crawler? You mess it up, you're done. I'm trying to get one right under that. Where I'm standing is actually not solid land. 
Um, this is the restoration project that was done here. Is that they put these huge logs on the sides of the stream and basically so it would, the water would dig out underneath. So this whole section on this side that I'm standing on is actually undercut. And really what that does is it gives it a spot for the fish to hide when normally it would be pretty shallow and easy for fishermen and uh, birds to pick them off as well as other creatures. So that was kind of done and dug a nice spot out for the fish to be. And so actually this is a small stream, but definitely some big fish can be through here. I thought you've caught one out of here before. I thought you have, or is that a different spot? That looks similar. I got some. What well, works on a whisk, I want to Ooh, look there's some little guys water. crawling in here. Is I take a look at that little guy crawling. And I reel it, cast downstream, and then put it right I wonder what that is. Oh, let's put him back. Oh, he's trying to crawl in my. Fingernail. No, 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 no. Oh. Man, I'm running into all the snakes. Okay. Here's a trick. I'm caught on this tree. Well, if I just rip it, most likely my line's going to go woo, woo, woo. Wrap right on there. So what I do... Just slowly bring it up. Hopefully this will work. Slowly bring it up. I'm just gonna kind of pull like this and it's gonna go whoop. Got it. Oh. I don't know. That felt like a bigger thump than I've ever felt before. Black jig. Felt like a pretty large thump to not be a hit, but. I don't think there's any, I don't think there's any snags in here. Unless I, I'm snagging something bottom, I guess. Yeah. One chance is probably all you're gonna get. Yeah, one opportunity. I guess that's one shot, one opportunity. I don't think we're going to get much out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that time, though, that we walked from East Corey Road all the way up to the baseball field and pipe? Yep. We saw a couple nice fish. We got that big floater. We saw the beaver. Yep. And then we caught two or three fish, like right. Yeah, right when we're about to leave. Yeah, that's very comical. Look at them walk along like this. I'm putting a sinking Rapala on. Oh. I know, before I call them over the jigs, I want to see if I can get a 
the sinking of Paula on and murky water was like my go-to thing. I caught caught a lot of yeah. Caught a lot of fish. And, uh, this way, this way. Uh huh. Kind of put a white jig on there. I put a heavy one on. Oh, my line got caught. No, hopefully my response would be a little more enthusiastic. Oh, speaking of, wow, that's a good fish. Oh my. Wow, that's a mammoth. Thank you. I thought I got snagged. Here we go. Oh, that's, well, that's what we're nice looking fish. for. And yeah, not as big as I thought it was. No, but so far about 13. Yeah, there we go. That's what I was. I, that was my first cast up there, actually. Not even the one I would use either. <laughs> you wouldn't use a brown? Uh, I usually use those when the water's more natural looking. When it's ah. I use the silver and black. Oh. That's a nice fish, though. Yeah. Yeah, I told you this was a nice fish. Before. Well, you know best. Wow, his teeth are sharp. There we See go. Take a of them? I'll uh, take a snapshot out of this. Look at him. They fight too. Well, probably the only one we're gonna get out of this hole. Huh? Yeah, probably. Although it looks like a good hole for him. Yeah, for sure. Oh, there's a fish. Oh, no, <laughs> he jumped and spit me right out. Probably a big fish underneath this tree uh, that hangs in the water, but sometimes it's hard to get exactly where the fish are. Once the water warms up, and then you get a good soaking uh, from the rain, fish will come way out and be more aggressive. But right now it's just a little too cold, but. It's promising. I was happy to catch a couple fish today and lose one. It's always good to just be out anyways. It's just enjoyable. So I enjoyed this and hope you guys enjoyed it too. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the next video. I've actually got a good fish on right here. <laughs> Oh, it's not that good, but oh, there we go. Cute little guy. Just unhook him. There we go. Small. Pretty though. Well, we'll put him back. That's funny. I already did my outro. You just never know when it comes to fishing. See you later.